traveling in a foreign land, I came across an old bird man who took me into his humble home where with his birds he lived alone. And all that evening his cottage rang as the birds sat listening and the old man sang. His voice was as strong as an eagle's cry, as mournful as the gray dove's sigh, hypnotic like the great owl's stare, haunting as the loon's fanfare, and the sitting birds added not one note to the song that flew from human throat. On and on throughout the night, the old man raised his song in flight. Until near dawn, he did alight and smiled at me, that Rhenish sprite with wise and face, but sparkling eyes, who suddenly, to my surprise, hopped across his well-worn littered floor and opened wide his chamber door. Then the birds, as men leave church, arose as one from off their perch and through the door, burst through the door to fly, to soar. And then I saw it, a simple thing. Free birds fly, we caged birds sing.